Hello everybody, my name is Vinny MC, and I know, I know, that may be crazy to hear, because I've gone for Killer Tough Gig for the longest time. Don't get me wrong, I've definitely had some name changes throughout my my time as doing YouTube, but um, I think this one is definitely here to stay. I found the name that I thoroughly enjoy, and that is Vinny MC, and I hope you guys are okay with that, you know, for all like five of you who watch this videos. but um, yeah, this is also serving as a bit of an update video for what I'm going to be doing with the future. I'm going to be doing more gaming related things, so if you don't like that, feel free to unsubscribe. And I know a lot of you will probably unsubscribe, unless like your family or friends, and I appreciate that. So, um, for those of you who are watching, I'll start the adventure that is called Dark Souls 3. Oh yeah, by the way, I'm not the biggest fan of the music in these games. It's not that I don't like how it sounds, it's that it like low-key messes up my game. But I'll turn it on just so for recording. Turn it on nice too. Here we go. Yeah, I'll turn it on louder than that. Here we go. New game, baby. Now I've I've played this game a few times. I will say. Yes, indeed. I don't care. <laughs> I know. You know, let's uh, let's get a Thompson in here. Don't worry about why I decided to go with that name. Um, some people may know. Now, this is always the hardest part of every single, like, FromSoft game. I know that's, like, the joke everyone makes. So, you know, I just kind of had to hop in there. I'm going with these. It's also Twin Blades. Why not? I'm always a big fan of the Young White Birch Branch. I know it's, like, not the best. It doesn't really do anything. It's just so it can run past the guy who shoots arrows at you. I guess if I really want to get rid of or just finish the first boss fast... I could go black firebombs. Nah. Anyway, for this character, I'm thinking small head, huge everything else. Actually, hang on. Maybe tiny arms. Bro, <laughs> give this guy the freaking beast titan build, dog. <laughs> for real. Yo, I'm literally making my guy the beast. <laughs> If you guys have never watched Attack on Titan, then you guys don't get what I'm saying at all. But if you, for those of you who've seen it, you get it. You get it, and you're like, damn, he's not he's not wrong about that. All right, all right, all right. Already off to a good start. Base detail, let's change that hair. <laughs> Am I just going to make the Beast Titan? Beast Titan's hair, it's like a middle part, right? Not middle part enough. That is a middle. Nah, not middle. Not no. Not. Uh. Let's give him some scraggly hair. But since I, I gotta get the beard too, he's got a big beard because he's a beast. Yeah, I'll go with that one. And let's get the color, hair color. Bro, does that look like any lighter? It really was. I think that might be good. And beard color. Now, sadly, I don't remember the eye color of the Beast Titan. I like how I've just embraced that this is the Beast Titan just because of the stupid look I gave his body. But hey, I'm, I'm, I'm not a go with it. You gotta go with it, bro. Sometimes it's all you need. Color of pupils. Yeah, I don't know. So I'll just leave it as that. He doesn't have any tattoos, obviously. Oh, that's why I gave him fur, too, bro. I think my brain knew I was making the Beast Titan before I even started making this character. <laughs> you know, he belongs in the favorites. Thompson the Beast Titan? Hell yeah. This is the guy. Alright. Time to time to go off on these bosses because I th I'm pretty sure I'm good enough to get like the first few down, no problem. Let me think. Udex Vort, Cursed Rot. Yeah, okay, I'm good. So this is low key gonna be on a speed run because I'm definitely not that good, but. You know, I can hold my own in this game. I've definitely played it a lot. More times than I can count. 
And I'm one of those guys who like never uses the Ashen Essence Flask because I just don't ever use that blue bar of mine, whatever it's called. I don't know like all the super technical stuff of these games, but hey, who needs to? I, if I'm if I'm having fun with the game, who cares if I'm good at it? But I'm not bad at this game, so no need to worry about that. This game still looks great too. Like. I know there's like some obvious, or not obvious, but just some of the texture quality and like some of the objects that aren't as important, you know, obviously aren't the best looking, but still, playing this game in 2021, kind of sick. What the heck is that? Oh, they all got those. They all got like squares on the bottom of those spires right there. That looks weird now that I look at it. Like the way those towers are hanging off the edge. I feel like that'd be dangerous. I don't know. Wait, is that Lopric? That is Lopric Castle, isn't it? Oh, that's kind of sick. Alright. Yo! Is that why my character's buried here? No, I don't, I don't know if you guys... I feel like a fool for getting hit by this guy. I'm gonna cry now. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, the freaking game theory where he talks about this game, and he's like, you were a member of someone close to Lothric, or some shit like that. He might be right, man. Like, that's why you're waking up in a cemetery right outside the castle. I don't know, dude. Maybe some, maybe all map pet ideas aren't as crazy as everyone thought they were. Like, sometimes that guy's brain moves. I don't really know why people hate him as much as they do. I don't, I don't know if it's actually they hate him. It's more just like... He's constantly like a meme to how I'm back. Or whatever. Alright, Udex is pretty easy. But his like freaking other form... At like end of game gives you some of the most trouble. I'm pissed that I got hit by him. Gives you some of the most trouble any boss ever has in the game. those of you who don't know what hang on I'm <laughs> this is not my day man <laughs> let me wrap this up real quick my guy whoa okay 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 I'm really gonna scream at this guy if he kills me here Okay, I just gotta dodge a little earlier, okay. I can't believe I had to use all my essence flasks on Udex. That hurts, bro. Like, I gotta be surprised if other Dark Souls players are watching this and just like shaking their heads in disapproval. Because of how poorly I did in that fight. Whatever, all that matters is like, I finished the fight. I, doesn't matter how you win as long as you do it. Let's look at this floating grass over here. Is that just- Oh, no, never mind. That is not floating grass. I am just a fool. I am a baka. <laughs> Freaking- Can we talk about that? The, all the, <laughs> the stupid people who are like, Man, I love saying Japanese words. Even though, like, there's really no need to keep saying them over and over again. Like- Freaking, if you've seen the Nya Arigato thing, it's like, come on. You're just saying meow, thank you, bro. <laughs> like, and then counting to three? Like, I feel like that's a children's song, bro. You're not impressing anyone. I know that's not the point of it. The point of it is, like, for people to, be, to dance along to and be like, I'm so cute right now. I'm saying something this Japanese aesthetic song. Break, bro. And it's just like, <laughs> now you're just weird and a little loser. Sorry for calling any of you out if you dance to that song, but please subscribe. <laughs> oh my god. No, I just I didn't leave. Dang it. I'm literally wasting time by doing this teleport. Whatever, it is what it is. Sometimes you, sometimes you gotta make mistakes to see that your choices matter. Because if you never make a mistake, you, you just start thinking, Dang, I can do anything and get away with it. Nah, meme. 
Like a Donald Glover be like. I'm kidding. He's probably made a lot of mistakes. But he's like one of the most successful people in the world, dude. Like, it's crazy how successful he is. <clears throat> I freaking love Donald Glover so much. Community, one of the best shows of all time. And he's hilarious in it. Troy's one of my favorite characters. If I'm being real, he's like my second favorite. First favorite being the Dean, of course. The Dean is just... I don't know what it is with the Dean, man. The Dean hits different in that show, and he's funny as hell. Anyway. <laughs> you know what? I, <laughs> I really don't want to be one of those YouTubers who are like, hey, yo, tell me in the comments, blah, 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 blah. But I'm going to do it just because I ain't got no shame. Tell me in the comments what your favorite show is, because I think mine is probably Community. It's just a classic. I've watched that show four times now once with one of my buddies once with my mom i didn't like watch it fully with my mom i just like kind of watched in and out while she was watching it but it's such a good show dude it's so perfect until like after season three because then it like dips a little bit for season four season four is not even like that bad it's only bad if you're like a big community fan I feel because but if you're just like an av average person like watching this show you won't even notice the dip in quality all that much but it just doesn't feel like community it feels like I was gonna say it feels like someone who just kind of never worked on it before started working on it that's exactly what happens they kick the guy off who started who originally made it Dan Harmon what a dude I don't know if I mean that in a good way or a bad way that's up for you guys to decide I ain't better start talking about stuff like that, dog. I'm just trying to have a good time. No! I'm literally dead. I'm literally dead. I'm literally a fool. <gasps> no, I'm broken. I'm OP. Alright, let's go, buddy. Come on. 1v1 me. GG will play? <laughs> so many of the things I say, by the way. <clears throat> they're just gonna be really dumb and make absolutely no sense but um i'm hoping after i do this stuff for long enough you you guys will be in on it no oh no 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 okay then i might i might already die i never fight this guy because i'm always so scared not that guy but the freaking lothric knight <clears throat> let's go buddy oh okay yep Exactly what I mean. I struggle with, like, people in this game so much compared to some of the bosses. Like, Vort? Well, Vort's just easy, so that's a bad example. But Osiris? Osiris I can handle pretty easily from, like, last time I played anyway. No! Oh, it's so close. That sucks. First death doesn't even go to a boss or some random knight. Whatever, it's a random strong knight, so I'm allowed to die to him. At least in my opinion. Ugh, but now that dragon's there, so I can't really go up there anymore. <sighs> There's probably so many secrets in this game I don't know about. There are so many secrets in this game I don't know about. Any of you guys watching who are like, oh, I wonder if he's gonna do any of like the side story quests and stuff, like Honory, I'm not. This isn't really like an in-depth playthrough. This is just kind of me playing for fun. Just thought I'd let you know. Okay, so I'm not going up there anymore, so at least ruining that dragon. This is the first time my plan has ever gone wrong in this section of the game. Because normally, I go up there, run around, wait for the Lothric Knight to pass so I don't have to fight him because I'm trash. Oh no, I just put them all in here. <laughs> this is tough, cuz. Okay, Lothar Knight's gone down the stairs, so if I just run past these dudes up to the bonfire, I should be good. I remember first time playing this game, I had no idea this bonfire was here. It wasn't until I read my Dark Souls 3, like, Claire guide that I realized that there's a bonfire here. <gasps> no, does the Lothar Knight come up here, too? Bro, just leave. Bro, this ain't your fight, man. Just, just let me be. 
I'm trying to live my life and kill a big ice guy. Yeah, come on. Let me race up this bonfire, dude. Like the likes. <laughs> okay, hell yeah. And I think, uh, this is the end of episode one. And I am going to be recording more of these. I'll probably, like, wait till episode one goes up to upload more, you know, to see the reception, see what people think. But no, screw it. I'll, I'll, I'll upload as many as I want. I'll do what I'm, what makes me happy, okay? I'm going to end this video on a life lesson. Do what makes you happy. As long as nothing you do hurts anyone else, you're living your life right, dog. See you in the next video.